I, I have no problem with, as a servant of court, you know, I'm a lawyer. I welcome a difference in opinion. And as an advocate, it's part of the growth in jurisprudence and law. Uh, it's a test uh, on the institutions of the Republic of Uganda. But uh, it's clear that the courts can make their own findings, can make their own uh, uh, inquiries and come up with decisions. It's not something that I'm here to challenge, but I would likely clearly say we welcome the decision, just like others from the... I, I saw the petition was under about 2016, mm. about offensive communication. Almost seven and, years. Yeah, almost seven years, and the court's finding is that it's not offensive for someone to express their opinion. I think that is the same thing we are talking about. However, uh, where we deferred is... Uh, uh, the issue of how you express yourself, okay? Whether in expression of your opinion you infringe the rights of others. Um, clearly studying the, uh, the ruling and the judgment from court and we'll give our opinion, a much more informed opinion later. But as it is, uh, we accept the ruling of court and uh, that shows that there is separation of powers in Uganda and that uh, every institution can operate independently. So that's the judgment of court and that is what we've received.